Hi, I'm Dale from Metro Account. I'm going to talk to you about the error message you may be receiving, can't communicate or can't sync comms, why it occurs and how to resolve it. All right, so here is your standard RS-232 serial cable. Uh, it connects into the Metro Account unit neatly. It's keyed to fit perfectly. Sometimes you just need to rotate it until it goes in. If you've got the housing, screw housing on the outside, you actually don't need that. Uh, it will work and connect without forcing that on or screwing that in. The other end is your standard USB end. Just plug that into your computer and we'll get started. So what we're gonna do is click on the red question mark, RSU status. One of the first things you should always do when connecting a counter. The can't communicate error has come up. Uh, this could be due to the fact that you have not installed your drivers, which would be found in your initial NT link that would have been emailed to you. The other reason is that you have previously installed the, the drivers, but you've changed the USB port that you've used. Or, it's the very first time you're doing this. So you can see there we have can't communicate. Let's go ahead and sort that out. I'm gonna click on view, settings, communication. And you'll notice in the top left hand corner, it says COM1. We're gonna click on the button next to it and see what's available. And you'll see there COM3. And under details, you'll notice that it says Metro Account USB adapter. So we know the drivers are installed. So let's click on that, make it blue, and click OK and OK again. Now, let's recheck. RSU status, we have connection. If that still has not resolved your communication errors, contact Metro Account for further help. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. You can see more videos here on MTE solutions from setup to analyzing data.